Hi you guys, so welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be talking about careers you can get with a bachelor's in public health. So from my experience, I got my degree at UC San Diego. I had I studied public health and I earned my bachelor's in 2019. So I'm going to be discussing some careers you can get into, their salary, um, if, you, if you want to go to your MPH program, what kind of careers you can get with that. Um, and then I'm going to talk about my own experience with a degree in public health and what I'm currently doing right now. So let's just get started. So the first career is a health care quality improvement analysis and they are also called healthcare quality improvement coordinators. You can also just find any career and search up quality improvement and your degree in public health can qualify for this job. but you may require certain skills and they make an average about 40k to 90k depending on experience and what they do is they ensure that facility meets all regulations and that there is patient satisfaction whether this could be like a hospital this could be the county so definitely check out hospitals or your count local county the second job is environmental health scientist and they make an average about 60k to 80k and an environment health Scientists utilizes their knowledge of public health and the environment to protect the public. This could be through research, through policy, this could be working with the county. Um, and they're making sure that the public is safe and they're reducing any hazards within the public health and the environment. Another job, this is common between my friends who majored in public health. They became a health educator or a health educator assistant. And they make about 30k to 80k depending on your experience. And first, a health educator teaches people about behaviors, promote wellness, implement strategies to improve health of the individual, collect data. And a lot of my friends who majored in public health got positions in um, health education. So definitely check out your county again. Another job is the fourth job is. Being a research associate or being a research assistant, they make an average of 30k to 60k and they contribute to a research project and conduct literature reviews, collect data, analyze data, prepare, um, prepare materials. You probably get this position if you were doing research in school. I did not do research and I had no interest in research, but I know a few of my friends and alumni got careers as research assistants by doing research while they were in undergrad and working with their professors or um, with their teaching assistants. So definitely make connections with your professors if you want to be involved and have a position in research. Another um, position is a health program specialist. So a health program specialist makes about 60k to 80k and they usually work with disadvantaged communities and you can find these positions usually in the with the county. They act as a health program consultant, they analytical admin position um, skills, technical tasks, they plan and develop programs, and there's lots of projects you can be a health program specialist for. You can be like specializing in obesity or tobacco or mothers and children. So definitely a lot to focus on. You just have to find the position and definitely check out your county. I feel like counties have a lot of public job. Another position is being a disease investigator and they make around 30k to 50k so disease investigator can also be called a public health investigator and these positions are currently if you've seen like with COVID you can be like a COVID tracer and that is a disease investigator so usually they'll conduct interviews with patients, gather information, um, gathering symptoms, history, source of illness, list of con close contacts, activity history so definitely a COVID tracer, um, that is something you can do and definitely a position that would be with like your state county, um, your local county. <laughs> Another position that was common between four of my friends who major in public health is healthcare recruiter. So a healthcare recruiter, they make around $45,000 on average and they focus on recruiting medical professionals for their for different organizations and they conduct interviews, assign employees to work sites, making sure the organization and individuals are part of these healthcare facilities. So that is something that a few of my friends did after graduating from graduating with a public health degree and with their bachelors. Um, and there's also some positions that require your master's in public health. 
and these are highly recommended if you want to enter these positions like being an epidemiologist which is like disease detectives and they make roughly about $70,000 to $90,000 also another position is a biostatician uh, you, and they will make about $75,000 on average and what they do is design, analyze, implement, implement targeted statistical studies which are gathered to further medical knowledge and improve research efforts in public health and that is something fun if you like enjoy doing statistics, math, and connecting that to healthcare. A few of, a few of my friends did this and are currently studying their master's in public health and focusing on being a biostatistician. Another career that requires your M a master's in public health and this one focuses on like health policy and management is being a health consultant. And they make an average of $80,000 and what they do is they're like management analysis, research the efficiency, the profits and structure of an organization and offer suggestions on methods of improvement. So similar to like a quality improvement coordinator. And then another position that you can get with your health policy and management um, if you have the master's in public health is being a health analysis and they make an average of $60 thousand dollars and they evaluate medical data to improve the business part of hospitals and medical facilities so which is a nice position to have but if you have a bachelor's in public health like i did some careers that i would check out is your nonprofit organization in your local area uh, checking with your county and their department of public health checking for internships and overall even your school current school will see if they're department has any positions for you after graduating. So for let me talk about my experience with a degree in public health. I actually had a hard time finding a job. I could not find a job after a year of graduating in public health and I think that is due because I didn't really do internships that really develop any skills and I wasn't involved in research or anything so I had a hard time finding a position in public health and looking back I probably wished I majored in something else or I went to grad school to get my master's in public health but currently I'm in nursing school I think I want to be a public health nurse or somewhere along the lines of being a public health nurse or maybe a different position department within nursing. There's, nursing is pretty broad so I can enter any department um, or different specialties so for me I had a hard time finding a position with public health. Public health is very broad with just your bachelors. So that's why I recommend doing internships while you're an undergrad, checking with your professors, being involved in research, getting some hard skills involved, research, data analysis, using statistics, um, and definitely check out your county if they have any open positions for you. It is difficult in general to get a full-time job. And then of course you don't need a bachelor's in public health to get into these positions. You can be in like biology, microbiology, and you can enter public health. And it's just a hard field and competitive field to get into. And definitely just get some skills and making sure you're connecting, making connections and networking and doing some internships. One internship I recommend is Health Career Connect. And that career, uh, Health Career Connect provides internships for students who want to be involved in public health and I think that's a great opportunity. Um, also, by the way, I'm located in California, so I had a hard time finding a position in California regarding public health. So there's lots of positions that I didn't talk about, so definitely research, um, check out different websites and let me know what kind of position you had. And if you have, if you've majored in public health and got your undergrad degree in public health, what did you do after? college? Did you find a position in public health? Did you go to grad school? Did you work full-time, part-time? Yeah, just let me know in the comments and if you have any questions, just let me know. Alright guys, so this is the end of my video and if you need anything from me, don't, for, don't hesitate to ask me in the comments. Alright, bye!